What's going on everyone? X Ninja Shot X here, back again with another statue tutorial. Today I have the second character on our list from the uh, Ruby cast, basically. Or Team Ruby, we have Weiss. Uh, this is the chick who is also with a skirt, like Ruby. Um, she's got a rapier. Uh, what do I even say? She's like Ruby's partner. Or whatever, for those who don't know. Um, kind of like the Ruby video, I'm going to probably have the first episode, I'm probably going to have the first episode in all of these Ruby uh, videos, just for those who are curious about the show, to go check it out for yourself. It's kind of like free advertising, man, they, they get free advertising for this stuff. But uh, yeah, this was a pretty interesting skin to design, I spent quite some time messing around with this. For those who don't know how I designed these, um, I pull up two Google tabs, and I look up Minecraft skins for whatever the person I'm making, and then I pull up what the actual person looks like. Like, I pulled up a thing of Weiss, what it, she looks like, and then I look through all the skins, like all the fan-made skins that people made her, and I compare and contrast all of them, and I just just kind of go off what I see, what I just build off of what, uh, everything. So, this is my version, and... I'm actually pretty happy with this. She was pretty irritating to make because of how dang white she is, but uh, I think she turned out looking really good, honestly. So, um, yeah, also this is a viable skin, so if you wanted to make, say, even the ruby skin or this skin in uh, Minecraft for yourself, um, feel free. You know, if you're checking this out and you're like, oh, that looks so cool, like, I've always wanted to make that as my skin on Minecraft or something, then you could, you could use this as a tutorial for that, you know? Go ahead. But, uh, alright, let's go ahead and just jump right in here. Let's not make this a very long outro like the Ruby one, because I was explaining a lot in that one, but we don't need to explain that now. If you want to get all this explained, well, Ninja News should have that covered today, so go check that out. So, here are the legs. They are 8 by 4 by 12. The torso is 8 by 4 by 12. The arms, they are attached or aligned to the torso, and they are 4 by 4 by 12. And the head is 8 by 8 by 8. Um, with a hat effect on the back here, it's her hair. Um, it kind of comes out on the side and in the corner here and on the back. Comes out one, comes down. Um, and those dimensions are length by width by height. So, uh, yes, that will also be in the description. Um, also, I will have some pictures in the plastic texture pack. Um, or some screenshots at the very end after I get done talking. So, if you have any part on here that is mildly confusing or you just want to see in a different version to make it maybe a little bit easier to understand or something, or just have a grid line of all the blocks, uh, check those out. So, here we go. Here is the front of the legs. Now, like I mentioned, there are quite a few whites here, and uh, the majority of her switches in between snow and white wool, because snow is a lot brighter than white wool, so it's the easiest thing to go with. So on her boots and on the uh, outlining of the skirt that she has, that is snow. And the rest of it is white. And of course her skin there is a birch wooden planks. Coming around to the side here. Uh, same colors here. The outlining is snow. A little bit there on the bottom of her shoes as well. There's snow. And then the rest of it is white. And her skin remains uh, birch wooden planks. Coming around to the back. It's fairly similar to the front. Just a bit of a difference on the uh, style on the, or the design on the boots. Just on the bottom this time. Or it's, it's just a little bit different this time on the boots. Um... That's all snow, rest of it's white, skin, same color, birchwood plank, or same thing, birchwood planks, and then uh, the skirt is uh, just a mirrored from the front. So, and also the uh, side of her legs, it's uh, mirrored from the other side, so a little rule of thumb that we have, uh, that both sides of the legs are the exact same, so just copy that right over. Here's the front of her, or the front of her torso, which is definitely the, probably most intimidating thing about her. Um, she has a belt on her, and... Uh, making that, making that nether or making that blocks of quartz, it just it didn't seem like the right color for me. Um, I don't know. This was a hard one to choose, uh, just based off of uh, this. I mean, it was really hard to. Th this was the one that I'm kind of iffy about uh, as far as the iron blocks, because that the belt on her is iron blocks or blocks of iron. Um, obviously, the top half of her is all snow, and then the bottom half is. Uh, white wool, um, and you can see some stone there and some red up by her neck, a little bit of black there, uh, right under the birch wooden planks, which is her neck, her skin, and then her hands are the same color. Um, she also has, like I did mention, uh, blocks of nether quartz 
there around the red and the stone. And I was considering making the blocks of iron that color as well. But I think the reason why I didn't is because that is a her belt is a different color from her hair. And her hair, I ended up making uh, blocks of nether quartz um, as well. Because when you have something that's like white on white on white, it's so... On white, it's like, you. I only have so many colors of white. <laughs> so I had to improvise a little bit. But... If you think that the blocks of iron look better as uh, blocks of nether quartz, feel free. M like, more than feel free to change that. So, um, to uh, blocks of nether quartz. So here's the side of the arm. Uh, I I'll give you a better version, even though it's the same on the other side. I'll give you, like, a better mirroring of it on the other side. Just same colors that we had. Uh, top half is snow, bottom half is white. And uh, a little bit of outlining of snow there on the bottom, of course, with the birchwood planks. Here's the back of her. This is... Uh, a bit more detail, not as or not, it's not as much, but uh, you can see there what I was talking about with the hair coming down. That is all uh, blocks of nether quartz, and same diff or the same thing, pretty much. Top half snow, bottom half white, and the belt is iron blocks. Uh, like I said, if you want to make that nether quartz uh, blocks, you can. Um, totally up to you. And then here is the side of the arm, better angle of it at least. Um, but if, of course, like a, a rule of thumb goes, just mirror that right across to the other side. It's the same thing. Coming up here, though, to the face. Hair. That's the style of it. It's all nether blocks, or nether quartz blocks. Um, her eyes have diamond blocks in them, and they are light blue. And then the white part is snow. Because white wool, um, just did not seem bright enough this time. So I had to make it snow. Coming around here. It's getting dark already. Jeez, man. It's getting dark already. What the heck? A um, little bit of skin showing here. Birchwood planks. The rest of her hair is completely another uh, quartz. I don't know why that's hard to say for some reason. Here's the hat effect, though. It kind of has a... I want to say a... Oh, I want to say a stair effect or a stairish kind of look, but stairs are not that steep. <laughs> Kind of has like a raising the bar sort of look, you know. Uh, this side is aligned with the very top of it. It stops just two before the top of her head, so it's just, uh, it's six tall, of course. And then the second one here, that is five, and that is two. Back of her head is completely uh, nether quartz blocks, and this side is actually the exact same as the side over here. So you could actually make both of these sides of her head the exact same, and then just have the hat effect, like, you know, like that's the only difference just both of the sides of her head are the exact same and then she just has a hat effect on that one side so that's the only difference on uh, that side compared to this side and then the top of her is just all plain so should be pretty easy to make the head even though it got dark uh, before I was even done with this but that's it for me guys for this tutorial if you have any requests uh, for any other Ruby characters um, I did mention that we we're gonna finish off Team Ruby if you guys have any requests for anyone else in the series, go ahead and leave that request or that comment in the comments and definitely leave us feedback on how you're liking these if you think we did a good job or something. I don't know. Um, <laughs> it's good to hear that. Uh, so, uh, apart from those custom skins, if you guys have any other series or any other maybe animes you like, or just maybe it doesn't have to be animes, it could be anything, any custom skins that you would like us to try out, uh, definitely leave it in the comments. And, of course, the norm, uh, skin pack skins, mobs from anything, really, mods, or from just regular in-game mobs, um, or YouTubers. Uh, we're not going to be doing YouTubers for some time, but it's always good to keep a tab on those things, what people want us to make. So when we hop back into doing YouTubers, boom! We have plenty of ideas of what we, <laughs> of what we need to make from what you guys have been asking for so long. So, that's it. Thank you guys for watching. And as always, I will see you for the next one.